I wanted to ask you something a little bit different about what is going on. Uh, some news that's coming out uh, involving the U.S. Navy relieving the captain who sounded the alarm about an outbreak aboard the USS Theodore Roosevelt. I want you to take a look at this send off that sailors gave him when he was leaving the ship. They're uh, chanting the captain's name there. Quite a remarkable scene. I, I, I pose this question to you to see if the White House had anything to say about this, given the fact that the president in the past has come to the defense of controversial figures within the Navy, like Eddie Gallagher. Is there any comment from the White House about uh, re the relieving of this captain and whether or not they plan on intervening? Well, one of my colleagues asked the president about this yesterday, just as the story was breaking. And the president was hesitant to say too much because he knew that the Defense Department was going to hold their own briefing, uh, laying out the rationale for why this decision was made. Uh, but when the president was asked essentially whether uh, this captain was removed because he spoke out about coronavirus, the president said, no, no, not at all. Uh, and then the Defense Department went a bit further and said that this was more of an issue of going outside of the chain of command, that the captain had sent this urgent letter uh, widely on an unclassified email uh, server and had lost the you know, the, the faith and trust uh, of, um, you know, the military. And that's why he was being moved out of this position. Uh, it's certainly something we'll ask about again today, of course. And as this video, which has really gone viral, I've been seeing it all over my Twitter feed right. all this morning, um, the, it picks traction. I, we'll press him on that again today. Yeah, I was going to say he may have lost the confidence of his superiors, but certainly those working underneath him or reporting to him did not uh, share those sentiments with that send off. Thank you for checking out our YouTube channel. Why don't you subscribe? It's really easy. Just click on that button down there. And for more news from MSNBC, click on any of these videos here for the latest interviews and highlights. You can get more videos from MSNBC with our newsletters. Head over to msnbc.com newsletters to sign up.